Hi, uh, this is a short video for the technicians in the hospitals that have received the COVID-19 EDAN IM50 monitors, uh, which are configured to provide ECG, RESP, PLETH, CO2, arterial blood pressures, and NIBP. Most hospitals that have received them have wanted to remove um, the majority of those parameters to just leave NIBP and SpO2. And what I'm going to show you now are two different ways to remove parameters. The first way is a uh, not a permanent removal of the parameters. They can be put back on by clinicians. And the second way is a more permanent way of removing the parameters, which can only be re re replaced by uh, technicians. So I'm going to start with the, the first method. Uh, we look along the toolbar at the bottom here and press the right hand arrow until we see module switch. The press module switch and everything that's ticked is available to be seen on the screen. So we want to remove ECG, RESP, T1, CO2 and arterial. So we untick ECG, RESP, T1, CO2 and arterial and remove the menu. The monitor will reconfigure itself and now we need to press the menu button to go into display setup and change the numbers of waveforms from 6 to 2. And we now have what is essentially a spot check monitor. The more permanent method of removing uh, parameters. Uh, before I get to the more permanent way, uh, if you wanted to bring parameters back, press the module switch and, and tick the various boxes that you need to, to put back onto the screen. The more permanent way to remove parameters, um, which it disables the ability of clinicians to re-establish them without a password, is to go into Menu, Maintenance, Factory Maintain, with a password of 998, and OK. Then we go to Module Switch, and here we can now see all those parameters. So if I start with ECG, we turn it off. If I go to Respiration, and turn it off. Temperature, turn it off. IBP, turn it off, and CO2, turn it off. If I remove all the menus, we now need to turn the machine off because the act of turning it back on again recognises the changes we've made in factory configuration. So we'll let the machine boot down and then I'll turn it back on again. When you turn it back on, it'll go through the, the reset mode, if you like. Uh, we'll bring up the EDAN flash screen to start. And then when it comes back on, we should just be looking at um, SPO2 and NIBP. Okay. And there we have SPO2 and NIBP only. At this point, the screen can be reconfigured from waveforms, where well, we have the waveforms, to large font, in which case we have SPO2, NRBP, and NRBP uh, trend or review. That's the end.